Scott and I have had the pleasure of training your Vancouver Midnight Dancer filly. We saw her and bought her at the premier sale in Melbourne. She cruised around, she just was very alert, went to get on with the job, just like Dad. I trained Vancouver, so I know his progeny well. I know the traits that he instills in his yearlings, and he certainly instilled all his best traits in this filly. I really, really like this filly. Um, obviously, we had a bit of luck with the, the progeny of Vancouver, and uh, mm -hmm. I think this one's very much in the in the mould of those successful ones that we've seen, and uh, she's showing all those sort of right signs and, and similar traits at the early stages. So uh, she got a nice idea. Uh, mm -hmm. I think she'll be a, a nice, sharp type for us. Um, she always indicated that from, from the early days at the sale, so it's good to mm -hmm. see her uh, train on with that in, in the early stages. Uh, again, whilst not a, a huge amount of pressure put on them, she's picking things up very quickly. Uh, she's got a good idea, and as I said, it's all coming quite naturally for her, which is the, the good indications and good signs at this early point. So uh, she's back at the farm now, uh, a, a good four-week spell. We'll, we'll just do her wonders. She'll uh, continue to develop and fill out. Uh, from there, we'll look to bring her back in for her uh, a second campaign in the stable and I think we can start to put a bit more pressure on her. I think she's got the physique to be able to sort of handle that, uh, the, the mindset to go with it as well. So uh, with that we'll, we'll like to see if she's an early type, we'll give her every opportunity to do so. Mm -hmm. uh, we'll give her exposure through the Melbourne and Sydney stables and uh, she'll be very well rounded next, next time. Start stuttering, get time by a half length. Three chips from nowhere will beat the most. And I am eloquent, has won it. Aristia won the Oaks from Graceful Glamour.